Additive manufacturing offers a short lead time way to make a part. What about capturing the model data? What about validating the part? Can these steps be done quickly too? Pete Zielinski, Additive Manufacturing Media, I am at IMTS, the International Manufacturing Technology Show in Chicago. This is Hexagon's booth at the show. Hexagon, measurement technology expert. This is the absolute arm, non-contact scanner capable of capturing model data from a physical object very quickly. 1.2 million points per second scan speed. Uh, it handles differences in reflectivity with uh, its shine technology. Systematic, high intelligence, noise elimination. All that together creates this fast, intuitive way to get model data. One user uh, not only does without physical inventory of spare parts, now does without digital inventory too. Instead of using a library of CAD files, scanning parts as they're needed is the fastest way to get model data. That is getting the model data. What about validating the part? Uh, particularly large additive parts, particularly made from metal. Additive manufacturing offers a way to get a near net shape metal part, but can we confirm that it wasn't distorted as a, as a result of the additive process? Can we get that validation? This is Hexagon's Marvel Scan system. One of its features is this extra camera sticking out at a right angle, and because of that extra camera, uh, just as an accidental side effect of the manual scanning, that camera tracks with these location markers that are placed in the environment around the scan. Every marker a little bit different, and it allows the scanner to know precisely its position and accurately compile a complex geometric scan. Here it's being used to scan the Zinger automobile with a chassis made from large laser powder bed fusion parts. A, a very intuitive measurement system for validating large assemblies, large components like this. Low cost as well. One of the system components is the handheld scanner, but as for the location markers, they can be placed on the walls and ceiling by the user themselves.